Yo, welcome back to my next Series X. You're always welcome. So I'm back in Altissa now after going back to the main map. The first map to do some quests, side quests and hunts. Man, this is beautiful, this part of the map. I took one of these boat rides and uh, I actually watched it rather than skip the travel and it was actually gorgeous. Um, so I think I want to go to here. Ah, the breeze feels good. Indeed. This is only a short journey, so I'll watch this, but looks wicked. They've done such a good job with this game. Can't believe I'm over 120 hours in and I'm still playing it. It's fucking insane. And nearly 200 videos in my playlist. I also find it hard to get the time to, to play, and I... I mean, I want to get the most out of a game, of course I do, but really I'm only pretty completing five games a year at the minute, which is not good. Well, probably more than that. If I have a break from open world games, it's more than that, but um, the open world games are my favourite. And uh, they're the ones I play the most, so they take the most time. But look at this, fucking gorgeous, man. It's beautiful architecture, like. Screen Enix done such a good job here this game so we're gonna do the Gentlemen, summit head to the first secretary's estate I also love the banter between the characters as well it's pretty cool I'm sure we can uh, get where we need to go up here There's like a Colosseum uh, here well, as well somewhere. Yeah. But I think we're gonna have to do some main quests before we unlock that. Right, here we go. Head to the first six days of state. This is the first main quest done in the while, I think. Once the negotiation begins, you will be unable to return to the city. Are you certain you wish to continue? Oh, let me check the map. I don't, there's nothing else in, in here. I mean, I can't... These other areas, there's nothing there. I can't really get to any of these other areas. Um, I don't know if I should try. I don't think we can. I don't think we can. Fuck it, let's just do this. Thank you for coming. The negotiation is about to begin with First Secretary Claustra. Engage her in a manner befitting a king and strive to win her trust and cooperation. No sweat. First things first. Express gratitude. Thanks for coming to greet us in person. It's the least I could do for a king. Westcombe didn't extend me an invitation, so I decided to extend my own. Though circumstances have changed, both the king and the oracle are finally in Altitia. You said that you have Luna in your care. Doesn't that pose a risk to your nation? Is the king concerned for our relations with the Empire? But it's true. The Oracle is a risk, one we are prepared to shed with. Whether we do so depends on you. Now, let me ask some questions of my own. Why does the Oracle seek to awaken the Hydrian? She just wants to talk with Leviathan. She would wake a slumbering goddess just to have a chat? Somehow I doubt the Tide Mother will take kindly to being nah, roused on a mortal I chose the wrong thing for that, I think. Let me be frank. 
The potential chaos worries me. You know better than most what took place in Lucis with the Archean. Tell me, what happened? The big guy woke up and went on a trip. Really? A mild way to put it. It will most likely come to war. However, I don't care to host a battle on my soil. The gods and the Empire be damned. I don't suppose you'd cry I'm just for guessing the Empire's it. losses? An intriguing suggestion. Seems to me you want a proxy to fight the Empire. Very sharp, Your Majesty. But before we go into that, there is one matter I'd like to settle. Without further ado, let us talk terms. If you wish to hold the right, you must ensure my citizens' safety and aid in their evacuation. That's fine, but what about damage to the city? Your concern is appreciated, but I am prepared to accept some structural damage. Keeping the citizens safe is my chief concern, and therefore yours. And that is not all. Once the rite has begun, I will not be accountable for what follows. You are on your own. Not a problem. We know how to take care of ourselves. Thank you. I'm sorry we cannot do more, but as I'm sure you are aware, few armies can stand against the might of the Imperial fleet. That is all for the terms. To review, you are to ensure our citizens' safety and engage the Empire. Do we have an agreement? Uh, fuck. Let's fight together as allies. Allies? Such a vote of confidence. Well, you can trust us to do our part and keep the Oracle safe. Oh, my decision I thought was a best. Probably made warning. some shit ones, but. Oh, I doubt it'll come to it. My duty is to my citizens. Should any harm befall them, there will be a reckoning for both King and Oracle. Uh... All right. You do what you must for your people. You're just like your father. What do you mean, like my father? Sometimes I can't tell whether you're sharp or dull. <laughs> Madam, it's time. Yeah, I was going to choose the uh, option at the top. But... Effort. Whom you choose is up to you. According to our intel, the Imperial fleet will be four warships strong. Fucking hell. Steal yourselves for a full-scale battle. I have confidence you will do well by us, and you can expect the same in return. <laughs> okay, Noctis made a positive impression on the first secretary. I think that's all that matters. Uh, rather be positive than negative. So that was quite a short man quest, the summit. I just hope I did make the right uh, choices. I can't promise something I can't help. Of course. You certainly opened up to them, though. What can I say? I have a soft spot for the young and tragic. They've lost Regis. They've lost the crystal. Was it so long ago the last oracle was taken from them? We've seen the Empire go mad these ten odd years. The day of the right. So before this we had the summit. So I'll be travelling to a new area of the city, I hope.
During the rite, we must see to it. The Empire does not harass Leviathan. Gonna be tough to pull off before the King receives her power. And with three of us on evacuation detail. Indeed. The best we can realistically do is to help the Hydrian help herself. What kind of help are you talking about? Just like Titan, the Empire will seek to immobilize Leviathan. Oh, with the harpoon things? If we can dislodge them from the Goddess, she will have a fighting chance. Sounds good in theory, but don't push it. It's pointless, unless you can get that blessing. Stay flexible, stay alert. All right, will do. So, when the Empire attack the Leviathan, the huge goddess, we have to attack the hooks. They're going to place into it to immobilize it, by the sounds of things. Luna Freya, Nox Fleury. 12 years. If worse comes to worse, you can threaten to throw the trident into the sea. Then they'll listen. In the meantime, it will be well guarded. Better than the Oracle herself. Understood. I shall reclaim it at the altar. Remember, you'll be under Imperial Watch. What the hell? Right. Think of it as a necessary evil in order to forge the Covenant. I am in your debt. The fuck's going on here? Once it's over, you may go as you please. But you do so without our protection. So be it. You'd better get going. Your public is waiting for you. Maybe we should... We should have demanded to see her. The fuck? That's strange. Man, look at them. Fucking assholes. Look at that architecture, and they're going to wake that goddess up. That thing's going to fucking destroy that sea. It can't be easy to uh, rebuild a city like that after destruction. Jesus, look at the size of that. Knocked. You in position? Yep. Don't forget the plan. You guys too? Of course. So... About a crowd with the whole one set to watch. Just checking something quick. I stand before you today with little hope the words I speak shall reach beyond these walls for slowly but surely the light fades from our world and as it does the shadows shall loom ever longer until all succumbs to the darkness I heard that I'll be like what the hell is this terror hatred and sorrow in the hearts of men. The ashes of Lucis. A dream of peace, twisted into a nightmare of death and destruction, claiming innumerable lives and leaving myriad souls to suffer. Luna. Yet I beg you, do not surrender to despair. Have faith, for our gods Watch over us, by their blessings, by the stars that light the heavens above. Our world will be delivered from the perils of the dark. 
I stand before you here in Altisha to call upon Leviathan, goddess of the seas, spirit of the deep. By the sacred right, I will commune with the Hydrian. But first, I offer you my solemn vow. On my honor as Oracle, I will not rest until the darkness is banished from our world and the light is restored. Bless you all. I wonder if she noticed Lock Noctis there. Knocked. The umpire's here. Here we go. I can see him. Drop ships are closing in on the board. Look for a vantage point to approach them. Okay. Look after the citizens. We got him covered. So it begins. <laughs> <laughs> 